Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be restoring this, um, I forgot her line. Grow and cut? Cut and grow. Um, the Bratz Magic Hair Cut and Grow Sasha. I've been waiting so long to literally finish my, um, or complete the line, like the growing cut line. But this girl has been so hard to find. And I literally have Chloe and Yasmin out of box and in box. And I would rarely see um, Sasha like for sale. And then one day I finally found this girl on eBay. And she was up for like a couple of days. And no one was really bidding for her. I'm guessing because of her like haircut, like her hair has been cut off as you can see but she has like her original dress so i was just like okay so if no one's gonna buy her i'm literally just gonna snatch this girl and i'm pretty sure i paid like 36 dollars overall like us dollars so that would be like something else in aud but yeah i'm so happy to finally complete the line and have all of the girls i'm, I'm kind of sad that they didn't include jade i don't know why like i feel like she would have like had the green color i don't know but yeah they only had sasha chloe and yasmin for this line so yeah also um this doll was supposed to be the doll i was gonna use for my insider video but as you can see i wasn't really happy with like how i filmed it like I was supposed to capture like natural sounds and I didn't like yeah that's why I'm doing like a whole voiceover over this video because the background noise in this video is literally just me watching like the bad girls club so <laughs> and Felicia came like just on time so I literally just filmed my video with Felicia and I figured I would just use this footage for my youtube channel because it's still good footage i just have to like not use the natural sound because you'd hear bitches fighting like no so yeah anyways back to the video um this is what i'm gonna be using to reroute her um it's pretty much like a dark brown and a yellow color and yeah, she literally came like this. Like, I guess it's not a bad haircut. It was kind of cute. It was a cute bob. But yeah, I want her like her inches back. So Okay, now that um, I've cut all of her hair off, there's still like, you know, leftovers and you're gonna have to like get some hot water just to soften the head, like the plastic, a little bit. And I use like a screwdriver to like just, how do you, I don't even know how to say it, like what are the words to use? Um, like scrape, like the inside of the head just so whatever's left, like the hair the stubbles will like come off or like go into the head and then like you're gonna like oh my god I don't even know what I'm saying um you're gonna use a tweezer to like <laughs> am I making sense I don't even know <laughs> like it's literally 2 a.m and I'm doing this voiceover I'm so tired but whatever I'm just gonna try to finish this video like this is not a professional video guys i'm sorry but yeah so as you can see you see what i mean like you're, i'm using the tweezer to like scrape the inside of the head and just get them hairs out like yeah but they're gonna be stuck inside the head so you're gonna use like a tweezer like a good one so you can just like pluck it out and 
just so you can get the head fully clean and ready for a fresh reroute. This is the worst voiceover, but whatever. I'm gonna keep it. I just feel like people who like come to my channel, like from seeing my insider video, they're gonna be like, wow, this bitch is crazy, but I was just professional in that video, guys. Like, I didn't wanna be like embarrassing, but yeah. This is my channel, okay? Anyways, um, back to the video. Yeah, as you can see, I'm literally scraping the book out of, like, them hairs. And sometimes it's such a struggle. Did you just see my... Uh, -uh. Okay, whatever. Like, you just don't... Okay, it's just me crossing my legs. It's fine. I'm not even gonna, like, go back and cut that part out. Um, yeah, so I'm still scraping the hell out of this head. Um, yeah. Yeah, I've been working on this video for, like, a week. And I'm at this point where I'm just like, okay, this voiceover is the last thing I'm going to do. And it's going to be uploaded. So, yeah. And I can't be bothered even, like, going back. Like, I'm just talking, okay? I don't know why I'm just rambling. Um, yeah, oh my god, did you see that? So that's all the hair that was, like, out of the head after tweezing the fuck out of it. Um, I guess I didn't film that part because it literally takes forever like you just have to like keep plucking it out of the head and like shake it up a bit and Yeah, that's all of it. Yeah, it was like a big hairball So now I'm gonna be starting the rerouting part and this is my rerouting needle and it's pretty much like this um, It's like thick needles Like they're not small as you can see and I just use this to like cut up uh, the top part and I use a scalpel knife kind of base and I put the needle through that and then I have a pick to help me um, poke the holes and widen them just so like if, if you do this like you'll have less broken needles like I barely change my needles nowadays like, when I first started and I wasn't doing that, like, yeah, my needles would just break so easily. But if you have a pick to help you, trust me, it's literally, like, it saves you a needle. So many needles. Anyway, so, um, yeah, this is how I, like, gather the hair and put it through the tool. Okay, now that, like, you have that... Um, as you can see, um, with the pick, it literally, like, you know, widened the plastic up, and your needle just goes in so smooth, it doesn't even, like, you know, struggle. And, yeah, having a pick literally does help, and you just, like, poke it, and get it ready for the next one, and there you go. It, like, saves time as well. And needles, okay? Save the needles. So yeah, rerouting does take a while, but honestly, like I just put on a show and just watch that while I'm doing this and I'm done. I don't know, it took like, this one took like a day because sometimes I just take my time. But if you're like, if I'm like, you know, trying to finish it quick, it does get done quicker. But yeah, I was watching like Bad Girls Club. <laughs> I don't know why, but with rerouting, I like to, like, go around that perimeter of, like, her hairline. Just, like, all the way around. And then just, like, finish the middle part. I just feel like it's quicker. I don't know. It's probably the same process if you just, you know, start wherever. But, yeah, as you can see, I'm just starting all around the hairline. And then whatever's left on top, I just kind of, like, fill it in.
Okay, we're nearly done with the rerouting part. I know, I nearly fell asleep. But, um, yeah, I'm just doing, like, well. <laughs> Yay, editing. Um, yeah, I'm never, never going to change that. But, like, as you can see, I'm just doing, like, her hair part. I guess I put, like, that, yeah, as you can see, the clips jump. Um, I'm so bad at editing. But, yeah. Finishing her hairline part. I like to, like, um kind of root a lot of hair in this part because you're gonna use that hair to like cover her parting and it's gonna be so much easier when you have a lot of hair to use for the parting part and now I'm gonna be using the yellow adding the color into her hair and yeah Okay, after the reroute, I'm gonna be using like this PVI glue to like glue all of that hair inside of her head. And it's pretty strong. And it's been it's what I've been using and it's been really good. So just do that. Okay, now that rerouting is done, I'm gonna be parting her hair and kind of just like setting it in place before I boil wash her. And I'm going to be using my pick again to um, help me do this. It's literally so useful. Like, even if you have, like, a rat tail comb, that's also the same. Like, you just need, like, something thin and small. And I'm going to be using that to, like, part her hair. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm gonna be using like this elastic band to like help hold the hair in place so when I'm boil washing her it stays in place and yeah it's pretty helpful So I'm going to be trimming her hair and I like to put the shoes on just so you know I can see the full length when she's like fully dressed and as you can see it's so long and I, I hate cutting hair I don't know why like I would just like keep it this long but honestly like yes you can see it's so much it's longer than her like literally Rapunzel and I want her to match the other girls so I'm gonna be just cutting that like floor length like a decent you know length and yeah i'm gonna be thinning it out as well as you can see it's like so thick at the bottom and it's gonna be heavy like it's so heavy her head was wobbling so i just thinned out the ends a bit and made it cuter now i'm gonna be washing her clothes and girl it was so dirty like if you see okay so yeah just put it in there i use like just normal detergent for that and I just like, and I use hot water, like warm, you know, not burning me. And it was, the water was so dirty. So yeah, always wash your clothes. Yeah, you can see like the water's so dirty. And yeah, so now that Miss Sasha is, I don't know, she looks so good. I'm so excited. And I'm, I think I'm just gonna like dress her at this point. Yeah, like she's, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, um, her dress does, like, it came with, like, so many snags and, like, threads just hanging. So, I just cleaned it up with, um, with scissors. Oh, my God, I'm forgetting how to talk. And, yeah, as you can see, they had, like, so many just threads just flapping around. And I just used my scissors to clean it up. 
period. Okay, now I'm gonna be dressing her. Um, I think, yeah, okay. Dressing her, getting her fully dressed, and uh, meeting the girls. I'm happy to, like, finally complete the line, because I didn't think I would. Like, I was like, okay, I'm never gonna find Sasha, like, what the fuck. And then I just found her on eBay one day, and then no one was bidding for her because she had the haircut. And I was like, girl, that's, like, an easy fix for me. So I just bought her, and now I have the line complete, period. Like, if she didn't have, like, her, um her dress then i don't know if i would no i still probably would have bought her even if she didn't have her dress but i'm happy that she did come with her dress because the struggle of like searching for that alone no so yeah she's fully dressed she's done i'm happy to like you know i said that already happy to complete the line and here she is fully done um what are you guys thoughts i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm sorry this voiceover is a mess but i've been working on this video for so long i just wanted to like upload it so whatever you can hear my crazy tired voice okay thanks guys for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it um don't forget to follow me on my instagram it's going to be somewhere on the screen or gonna be in my description down below also i'm gonna once like my um insider video is out on youtube i'm going to be linking it down below as well and probably on my next video so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys enjoyed the inside video oh my god i forgot how to talk the insider video and yeah i will see you guys on my next video i'm going to be um doing my pride dolls for my next video okay so look out for that pride month is nearly over but i'm late per usual um whatever okay i'm going to bed thank you guys for watching the video bye